Great. Hi, everyone. Um, so in this tutorial, I'm going to give you a walkthrough on the um, first few steps on how to build a 3D Temple of Isis from Pompeii. Um, and this tutorial was created by Valeria Vitali. Um, and the step-by-step -step PDF can be um, found in the link below. So you'll also want to download the um, zip folder attached, um, which contains all the textures that you'll need for a following video. So uh, in this first video, I'm going to walk through uh, building the main structure, as well as drawing the um, arch doorways. And if you are new to SketchUp, I would recommend first watching um, our video on introduction to SketchUp and simple actions. So getting started, um, the first thing we want to do is to delete this person here. And then you're going to go to um, triangle, or sorry, rectangle, to build the base of the building. So you'll start at the origin point and drag it out however you want. Um, and as we mentioned before, it's important that once you unclick, do not click anything else, just immediately type in the coordinates, or sorry, the measurements. So for this measurement, I'm going to do 13.2 by 7.5. And you can see um, it's been typed in in the bottom right-hand corner. And I'm using a European keyboard, so I punched in um, comma instead of a decimal. So press enter. And now it's to the proper scale. So the next step is to build the external walls. And to do this, um, you're going to choose the offset tool and click and drag inside of the rectangle. And then you will enter the measurement of 0 0.44. Um, so next, to raise up the walls, you use the push-pull and make sure that the outer um, walls are highlighted. So you click on it and drag your mouse upwards and then type in a value of six. And so now we have our nice box. But in order to make it a building, we want to add some doors. So how we do this, is first you're gonna to want to put it on a good viewpoint. So go to camera, standard views, and front. Then you select the tape tool, and this creates guides for you. So you will click on the um, left side and drag it anywhere, um, but enter the value of 0 0.73. So now we have our first guide. And you're going to repeat this action um, with the values given in the um, uh, guidelines. So you now have um, five vertical guides. And you just repeat this process from the um, from the right edge with these same measurements.
Okay, so once you have all 10 vertical guides, um, you will follow the same procedure by um, creating two more guides starting from the lower edge. You just draw your guide upwards and put in the measurement of three and another one at 3.6. So next you want to select the rectangle tool and draw three rectangles in the intersection of the guides. So, yeah. And here. So next um, to create the archway, you use this arch tool. So using the arch tool, you will start on the um, left corner, clicking, moving to the right corner, clicking again, and then moving back to the middle, but without clicking, dragging it upwards, and then clicking on the second line. So now you have your arch, and you just repeat this process for the others. So now that you have um, your arch, you can just delete these lines by clicking the eraser tool. And then you will just copy one of these um, to paste them onto the other side without having to redo the entire process. So it's, um, I'm using a window, so it's control to select and um, copy and paste. And paste another one. There we go. And the um, next thing you'll wanna do is to delete your guides. Um, so instead of going um, through each one um, and clicking delete, you can just go to edit and uh, delete guides. There we go. So now we want to create the door openings. So if you rotate your models, you have a bit um, more of a perspective here. You can choose the um, push-pull tool and uh, clicking on one of your archways, um, pushing it inwards. And um, it should automatically, yeah. If you push through enough, it'll just delete it from the other side completely. And if you double click on the next ones, it will repeat the same action as before. There we go. And so now we have our structure. And in the following, in the next video, I will show you how to um, add texture to your wall so that it more resembles the Temple of Isis. <laughs>